Viongozi kutoka kaunti ya Mandera wanasema kuna haja ya kuungwa mkono na serikali ya kitaifa kuchukua hatua za haraka katika kukabiliana na majanga ya mabadiliko ya hali ya anga kulingana na viashirio vya mabadiliko ya hali ya anga kusaidia wawekezaji na hatua za kukabiliana na hali hiyo mapema badala ya kujibu majanga ama kujibu majanga au kutotoa msaada mara kwa mara tu serikali za kaunti zinapokuwa na uhitaji mkubwa Wanabari wetu Grace Nganga ana mengi. Baadhi ya viongozi kutoka kaunti ya Mandera wanaitaka Wizara ya Maji kuanza mikakati ya kuvuna maji yanayotokana na mafuriko hasa katika kaunti kame na nusu kame ili kusaidia kupambana na ukame katika msimu wa kiangazi unaosababisha vifo kwa ajili ya ukosefu wa maji. Just imagine now we are crying of floods, floods, floods water. The next three months no water. That is the situation and the government of Kenya, His Excellency the President and the Ministry of Water, they should look at ways and means of harvesting uh, these waters. Mafuriko hayo anakuja baada maeneo hayo kukumbwa na takriban miaka mitatu ya ukame ulo sababisha maelfu ya watu kuhama kutafuta maji na malisho. Kwa sasa wakazi wanatatizika katika kaunti hiyo baada ya mafuriko kusomba mali zao na hifadhi ya vyakula kuharibu maelfu ya nyumba na kuwaua watu watatu miongoni mwao wanafunzi wawili waliofanya mtihani wa KCPE uliokamilika wiki iliyopita. While rains have successfully elevated our water scarcity, they are also unleashed they have also unleashed devastating floods that have brought sorrow and hardship. As of today, more than 12,000 households has currently affected by these devastating floods and approximately 4,000 households have been displaced from their homes. Seneta wa Mandera Ali Roba ameitaka serikali kuingilia kati na kusaidia kwani baadhi ya county hazikuwa tayari kukabiliana na mvua ya aina hii. Whatever happened and uh, the briefing that was given to His Excellency the President we don't know. Later the president made a statement saying you know we are grateful to God that that El Nino situation that was forecasted is no more. However we are here to make um, a very firm statement that the situation as it is in these counties are worse than the 1997 El Nino period. Kando na wizara ya maji wanaitaka wizara ya afya pia kuingilia kati kwani kuna athari kadhaa za kiafya zinazoambatana na mafuriko. Baada ya hii mafuriko tutakuwa na shida kubwa ya mripuko wa magonjwa kama kipindupindu ama magonjwa ya kuendesha na pia e, wale mbu ambao watazaliwa kutokana na athari hii ya, 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 ya mvua ni, ni, ni hatari kwamba tutaweza kuwa na malaria ambayo itaweza kuleta matatizo mengi kule kwa zile choo ambazo wanazotumia kule ni choo za shimo na visima vile wanatumia kule ni visima ambaye zile tunaita shallow wells kwa kimombo kwa sababu ile mafuriko ile shallow wells imejaa imeleta maji yake juu na zile choo pia zimejaa zimeleta ule uchafu wote juu Grace Nganga KTN News Nairobi Na mtazamaji taarifa hiyo na nipa fursa ya kwenda kwenye pumziko fupi ila nitakuwa narejea na mengi ndani ya muda usio kwa mrefu salia ulipo